Hey there everyone, what's going on? It's Jordan Johnson and it's time for another episode of The Hack of All Trades. I am your resident hack of all trades and I am here to just just chat. Today's just about chatting. No new tech, no new whatever. Um, I did get another new deck of cards. Look at those. Boom. Boom. Those with these... Boom. Boom. Get your fill. Yeah, look at those. If you're listening, you should go check out the video. I got two um, awesome decks of cards. Um, and the second one came in the mail yesterday. So um, that one's pretty cool. Here I can open it up and show you. Um, and this is also printed by that company. And it's the same artist that I mentioned yesterday in that video. Just a beautiful deck of cards. And not to mention the slip is like insane and very detailed. And oh wow, look at that. Printing. High quality printing, St. Clove. St. Clove Street Press. Um, all right, so here's the back of them. Let me get this nice, nice and close. I can't fan. I'm not like a magician card handler whatever i don't mean to offend any magicians out there um so there's the the back one really nice Ooh, the symmetry i think it's probably my lights not focusing and um yeah and here's the the faces on them Ooh. very um graphical a lot of really nice line work um, the artist did a great job on these. Kevin Cavallari? Is that how I say his name? Kevin? I'm sorry. Kevin, if you're one of my listeners. <laughs> I apologize if I butchered your name. And uh, yeah, these were done um, in conjunction with a whiskey bottle design that um, his studio did. So pretty cool little deck of cards. If I'm ever going to play a game of cards, I got a nice little... A little deck to impress the people with. Um, really, that's about all that's new in my life. Um, I do have some, as always, some fancy new audio gear on its way in. My um, amp for my speakers is kind of crapping out. And so I got this little guy. Um, what's he uh, called? Why don't I pull it up so everybody can see? Um, Amazon. So let me see if I can pull this up here for everybody to see. Um, and let me see if I can get this working. So we, hey, give me Brave Browser. Let's see if that works. Boom, there it is. All right, so, um, I got uh, one of these little duder, doodads. Um, and oh, of course they have a, a pro. Ooh, it's so professional. Oh, wow. Wow. Um, so basically this uh, topping MX3 here, um, what it will basically allow me to do is... Um, It'll kind of act as like a preamp before my headphones, and it will kind of um, act as like a, well, just an amp for my speakers, and it's like a Bluetooth receiver too, so I can just send my phone signal right to it and just play music from my phone. It's got a wireless remote. Um, it's really just kind of meant to be the all-in-one. Um, so basically, I would have my computer audio coming to this thing via optical audio, and then I would have it go out. Um, I would basically have it go out to the speakers from the back here. And then on the front, with this microphone out on the front, or this, not microphone, aux out on the front there, that will actually go aux out and into the back of my headphone amp. You can actually do this without, you know, people ripping your head off for plugging an amp into an amp if you can basically send the signal out from the first amp 
at line level into your headphone amp. This unit in particular has the ability to do volume in decibels um, or like 0 to 100, 100 being max volume. So what you can do is set it to basically decibels and um, set it to 0, which pretty much puts you at line level, meaning it will not introduce distortion into the chain. Um, and I can basically have this right before in the chain, right before my headphones. Um, so I can basically choose, you know, am I going out to the speakers or am I going, you know, out to my headphones? Um, so it'll be a nice, convenient and easy way to do that, um, which I am very, very excited about. Um, and yeah, this thing should be arriving next week. And so I'll probably have a nice video on this guy. Um, and all of its cool functionality, um, I might might have to reconsider how I set up my actual chain. But um, really, this is um, I don't know, pretty pretty exciting little little gadget for me to uh, be picking up. Um, kind of completes my audio setup um, to a point where I'm like extremely extremely happy, happy happy man. Um, so yeah, that's really about that. Um, uh, that's kind of the new gadget and gear in my life is this Topping MX-3. And um, other than that, just kind of been hanging out, everybody. Just kind of hanging in there, doing my best. Like I said, work has just been crazy busy. That's been keeping me extremely busy. So much so that I barely even had time to record this today. I looked up and it was 4 o'clock in the afternoon and I was like, dang, I'm already at the end of the day. Whew, another day gone by, my friends. Don't take them for granted. Some of them slip by real fast without even knowing. Enjoy yourself is all I'm saying. You know, keep things positive. Really just want you to go out with the bang this week. And uh, stay positive. Enjoy your time. Rest. Keep your mental health. Top priority. Be happy. Your happiness is paramount. As our friend uh, Patrice O'Neill would say, your happiness is paramount. Um, so sometimes put yourself first, take care of your health, do what you got to do. And, um, yeah, that's, that's about all the, uh, advice. It's about all the talking about all the blabbering I think I can do today. I know real short this one, but Hey, maybe you just wanted a short little check in just to know I'm okay. I'm okay, everybody. And I'm still hacking around. Uh, just been a little busy. So hope you enjoyed this episode short and sweet to the point. I don't really know what point, but that's about it for uh, for today. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching, everybody. Peace out.